Gomei is one of China's leading electronics retailers and sells everything from fridges to televisions to computers. Its footprint is quite large, has about a thousand, a thousand plus stores, and those stores are about 35,000 square feet. It's trying to differentiate itself in terms of its competitors around range, price and service and segment some of its stores to different types of consumers. It's also making an aggressive play in the lower tiers where consumer electronics are beginning to become much more important. In 2012, Gome overhauled its store network, closing 45 underperforming stores and opening 62 new locations. The changes were part of a strategic effort to increase store productivity in Tier 1 and Tier 2 cities by enhancing its customer experience. At the same time, it focused on improving brand presence in fast-growing third and fourth tier cities by adding new stores. Gome expects appliance sales in those markets to double to 160 billion US dollars by 2016. Gome also plans to implement supply chain improvements to produce efficiencies and a much more relevant product mix for servicing both higher and low tier markets. It's also aligning its online and bricks and mortar operations to produce economies of scale. The strategic partnership with Lenovo, the PC and mobile device maker, it will develop customised products sold only in Gome. And the retailer's flagship store will feature a Lenovo Experience Centre to promote the Lenovo brand. Gome also plans strategic partnership with Higher Samsung and Siemens. To rapidly broaden its online impact, Gome will partner with e-commerce platform Dangdang Dang to launch the Gome Online Mall. This will sell general merchandise such as books as well as electronics. Gome's e-commerce sales rose 242% in the first half of 2012, admittedly on a low base compared with the same period in 2012. But there's also been fierce competition and the downturn in the real estate market that's eroded consumer demand for home appliances, hurting Gomez's sales and profits. The transition that Gomez undergone and the general weakening of consumer electronic sales in China has resulted in Gomez's sales sliding some 22% in the first year. Clearly a revival is much needed.